Hey everyone, welcome back to some more Plague Inc. Uh, I think this is going to be the last uh, one of these videos I do. This is because most of what's left is pretty much just, it's mostly just the same. Uh, like, the parasites next, the parasitic life sovereigns, DNA alteration from everyday infection. It It's mostly just ends up being like the bacteria or virus. The prion's pretty much the same. It's slow. Uh, it doesn't take evolution immediately. The nanovirus sounds fun, but all it really means is it escaped from a lab. They already know it's out there, so they're already working on a cure to start with. All its unique abilities is pretty much just delaying them from broadcasting and kill switch. So, other than that, it works just like the other stuff. And the bioweapon is just the same as everything, except that its lethality naturally increases with time. And the specials are to basically delay and cancel out the lethality increase, and then it will reset it. But most of them pretty much all work the same. They're not really all that unique. So we're going to go with the Necroa virus to finish this off. It's a fucking zombie virus, so why not? So what do we got? We'll take the catalytic switch. Uh, which genetic mimic? Your plague is harder to cure. That actually sounds like a good idea. Um, increases chance of spreading by land... We're gonna need. We're gonna. We might want to just make it an aqua site for the fact that uh, we need to get to those islands. Um, arid climate be, is good, and I haven't unlocked any of. Uh, they're unique. These are unique to the Necroa, so. And let's go. Same name as always. So zombie virus time. It doesn't start out as a zombie virus. We're going to start in Saudi Arabia. Okay, warning to crow the virus. I don't then extreme regenerative abilities combined with aggressive metabolic demands, but most of its genetic structure is a mystery. Okay. So, we have unique trans. the transmission vectors are different. Uh, what this does is mutation chance, make cross species infection possible, increases future. It increases the research speed because they can, you know, check out more stuff. Other than that, you got kind of the basic things here. The symptoms, on the other hand, are different and get here to about here which is where it starts turning corpses into zombies and then everything down here pretty much affects the zombies so yeah let's just let this build up for a while all right now Virus replicates faster in Salvatore. So let, yeah. Let's get this for some more infection. Slobber on people! Yeah, it's already spreading good there. Damn. Try that and then get on water. <clears throat> the big challenge with this one is that when zomb when you start turning people into zombies, well, you'll see, but one of the things is you gotta New fall in urban population density. That sucks. Okay. 
blood and air. Plague Simulator game goes viral. Brilliant mobile game Plague Inc. <laughs> it's a huge viral success. Not a whole lot is happening. There we go, it's starting to infect more countries though. At least it's spreading. There we go, now the planes are starting to... Like I said, now, now the plagues are starting to go everywhere. Saudi Arabia, man. <laughs> Got one in Canada. Get some more water infection going on. Go to Greenland. Damn it. Okay, we need to make it resistant to antibiotics so it gets the rich fuckers. Got yeah, infected ships going pretty much. Well, oh, okay. Hypersalivation symptom mutated. Making people drool, yo! Madagascar can kiss my ass. Eh, it's making people drool. We'll work on it a little bit. Scientists concerned. It could cause tumors. I don't really know about that. Will somebody fucking go to Greenland? Yes, we're on the watch list. Good for that. Go to Greenland in all of its icy glory. China shuts down the seaports. It's just making people slobber. It ain't that bad? Oh, fuck you, Mexico. Okay. It's gotta survive in the cold. We need to get some defense against it. I need infected people in every country. That's alright. Spread through fucking them places. The London Olympics. Good for it. Thank you! We finally got some fucking zombie people up there. Thank you for the bonus. Polyphagy. 
however the fuck you pronounce that. Free shit! Don't want to spend too much more. The world is in for a nasty, nasty support. Mutation patterns. Ex this will set back. Will damage cure efforts. Okay, cool. Setbacks. Give me stuff. Everyone's just like, God damn, we're like slobbering all over ourselves. The fuck. Sea levels are rising because of the amount of fucking slobber. Come on. Fear slows the economy, but I have every I have I have things in every country, so so what do we have? Yeah, saliva production, compulsive hunger forces continuous eating, lack of hygiene increases risk of infection, insomnia sounds good, fever, frequent vomiting, Photophobia. Hmm. Compulsive to bite or partially devour our own body, typically fingers or skin. That's interesting. Com extreme compulsion to bite. Eh. Delirium. Psychosis. Eh. There's fucking cannibalism and shit. They're eating people. They're eating people. They're completely focused now. They're completely focused. The dead are just rising because of people eating. It's like, they're not even zombies yet. They're just eating each other. They're like, nom, nom, nom. What isn't... Uh-oh. Well, it naturally developed itself to reanimate the dead. Luckily, every country is infected, so now the zombies are eating people! Lactic acid buildup is lethal and destroys higher brain processes and personality. Okay. Enhanced motor control. Nutrient flow. Improving movement and coordination. Ninja zombies! Enhanced sight and hearing increases severity. Yay! Let's get some of that too. Zombies attracted to movement and will abandon the victims once dead. Prey more likely to remain intact and become a zombie. That sounds cool. Om nom nom, nom. is a world zombies. Om <laughs> nom 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 nom. He <laughs> got a zombie bar building up. It's turning people into zombies. Faced with overwhelming evidence, government confirmed that Thanatos' legacy can c trigger pathological aggression in corpses, but say that the situation is under control. 
Yeah, you know, there's only almost two billion zombies in the world. Three billion zombies. Zcom project activated in Iceland. <laughs> in response to growing zombie threat, a powerful military organization called Zcom has been set up. Its mission: defend humanity from the dead. Zombies destroy Korea. Zombies have hunted down the last group of survivors in Korea. There's no one left alive, and without food, the zombies will begin to starve. Oh, crap. Everyone's getting eaten, yo! Catherm Simulation and primary visual cortex improves vision and bright sunlight. Significantly increases severity. Okay. Vampiric hunger. Zombies prefer to suck the blood from its prey rather than eat the flesh. Prey more likely to remain intact and become a zombie. So, we have a vampire virus. Alright. Thinning of the nasal significantly heightens zombie sense of smell. <laughs> Adrenal surge. Increasing alertness and aggression. Yeah, they are, they are now ninja zombies. Strengthens zombie grip, making it nearly impossible for prey to break free. <laughs> Masticatory muscles become engorged, allowing zombie to bite through thick clothing. And possibly body armor. Peptide surge. Extreme metabolism of fat to build muscle. <laughs> now they're on steroids! I think I'm gonna wait. <laughs> now we have tanks. Where's like that last? Oh, it's like the la last few people in. Oh, Iceland's got. Zcom's being a little bit annoying. Acidic saliva. Increases severity and gives zombie a combat advantage. Yeah, they're gonna need that. They're, uh... Zcom grows stronger in Iceland. Oh, shit. I might actually lose. Zcom's built up significant defenses in Iceland against zombies. Soldiers and civilians are fighting together to survive daily zombie attacks. Uh oh. Fuck. Well, I lost because Iceland got its shit together. Well, fuck. A coma, assholes. It's like nobody left infected. They have a coma anyway. I was defeated by Zcom. Zcom expands and accelerates. Zcom decided the zombie threat in Iceland is over and allocates more resources to expand the Zcom project globally. Problem is, Chief, everybody else in the rest of the world is either eaten or dead. <laughs> so, yeah. 
Survivors will find it hard to rebuild civilization. Fuck you, Iceland! Humans fought the zombies and won. Fuck! Oh well. You get the basic idea. I, sh I guess I should have went more towards... Since so many people were infected, I probably should have just focused more on combat advantage. That was my fault. Okay, well. So, that's Plague Inc. I'll catch you guys later. Adios.